This is my turf. You're gonna play on my rules. Fuck the gloves. No rules. I'm gonna literally kick your ass if I see you over here. I am a convicted felon. I was convicted of grand larceny for stealing credit cards from my job. Man, like I stole credit cards from people that trusted me as a server. And I had this little trick where I could trick people to get them to leave their credit cards behind. It's a long story. I don't normally talk about that specific crime. And not being in a whole lot of trouble before that, I mean, I had a couple misdemeanor convictions. I spent a year in jail for one of those, but I've been arrested, I don't know, maybe 20 times in my life. This particular time is just not any more relevant than any of the other times. Now that being said, I don't ever think of myself as a bad person. It's, it's an interesting thing to ponder. And if it weren't for the fact that I'm on felony probation, I don't know, man. I, I feel like it's a huge motivational factor in my recovery, the fact that if I wasn't on felony probation, I, I, I don't know, man. Uh, it's, it's an interesting thing to ponder. Right? I go through mental relapses almost every single day where it's like, eh, no, Charlie, you need to like check your thinking here and start redirecting your thoughts somewhere else. I have a lot of character defects. I'm a very ungrateful person. I'm a very selfish person. Get, I would get right up in between those butt cheeks and dominate her anal cavity every single night. And by the time she's 45 years old, she's going to be shitting in a diaper. I bend you over and social media fuck you in the ass and take all your subs. I control fucking media on vegan YouTube land, okay? I do. Why should I take time out of my day, okay, out of my busy schedule to go and hang out with what's generally, I, I would say, you know, a bunch of stinking, dirty, hippie, vegan weirdos. <laughs> Vegans can get on their salty fucking knees and suck my cock! Play by fucking vegan cheetahs rules and that's just how it goes. There's that part of me that really does want to use still, you know? There's a part of me every single day because it gives me a higher purpose. I'm a businessman. I'm trying to run a business. Uh, he's not vegan. All right, this is a screen grab I just got of one of his vlogs where he ate, he says he accidentally ate cheese. So I want you to notice that this sandwich has not been eaten yet. All right, it is untouched and you can see that there is melted cheese sprinkled on top of this damn sandwich. All right, there's no accident when you admit that there's cheese on it and then you consume it and you try to say that you're vegan. All right, the hypocrisy is fucking astounding, all right? And I'm really pissed off that this keeps perpetuating and going on and on, and everybody seems to think that it's okay that Charles calls himself a vegan, yet he eats cheese, yet he buys fucking chicken ramen noodles. It's bullshit, people. Wake the hell up. Look right there for yourself. There's cheese. Watch the damn video. You judge for yourself. Don't make the reality that you want to see. Realize what's in front of your eyes and wake the hell up. That's damn cheese. He chooses to eat it. You don't choose an accident. How is it so far? Wonderful. Wonderful? Can I try one of your chips? Thanks, bro. Have a great day. Oh, is that cheese on the bread? It looks like cheese. We're just gonna pretend it's not there. Real fucking quick, cause you're starting to piss me off now. I control fucking media on vegan YouTube land, okay? I do. Girl should look in my personality. Charles, I have a son who is diagnosed with mental retardation. He didn't get oxygen to the brain quickly enough at birth. So this hurts my heart, because I'm a viewer. My son gets called retarded and bullied. This is gonna be good. Charles, I have a son who is diagnosed with mental retardation. He didn't get oxygen to the brain quick enough at birth. So this hurts my heart because I'm a viewer. My son is called retard and bully. Well listen, if this is true, then you should get the fuck out of my anons and take care of your retarded kid. Then you should get the fuck out of my anons and take care of your retarded kid. <laughs> And 
Yes, my addiction has translated into the more positive aspects of my life. But staying in is a huge piece of this, man. Will I be clean a couple of days from now, a year from now? I have no fucking idea. But I feel like in the moment, that is meaningless to eat. And if you want to eat shit in a bucket, nigga, that's fine. I'm just a social media personality. Calling my name right, I really don't care what they say about me, to be honest with you. So ethical vegans can get on their salty fucking knees and suck my cock!